Hello friends, welcome back to English Avant Behala. Today we are studying adjective. So we have to get to know what is adjective. Adjective is a word that describes a noun. It's a describing word. Adjective is called describing words. So it describes whom? It describes a noun or a pronoun. How the noun is? That, that is described by a word. That word is called adjective. It is a word that tells something about a noun or a pronoun. That is adjective. Adjective is a word that tells something about a noun or a pronoun. How the noun is? Which noun we talk about? What noun or what pronoun? Well, how the pronoun is? That is adjective. So it says how the noun or pronoun is. What I told. How many nouns are there? Well, what the noun or pronoun is? Whose noun, etc. So whose noun? Well, so nouns are things. So whose things? Well, so my my things. Well, whose bag is this? My bag. So my as a adjective. Because the word my describes well the noun bag. So it is called adjective. Well, such as example, Arantik is a good boy. Well, so which boy? What? Which? How? Whose? So these are the words we can use to ask the questions to the noun. And whatever the answer we get, that answer is called adjective. So how the boy is? No, good boy. Boy is good. So that is why good is adjective. So it's a describing word. Describes the word noun, boy. Next, there is enough food. Well, how much food is there? Well, enough food. So the word enough describes the noun food. So enough is adjective. This pen is mine. This pen. So we are demonstrating. We are showing this pen. So which pen? No, this pen. We are asking questions with the word which to the noun. That which pen? Answer is this. So that this is adjective because the word this describes the noun pen. This is my pen. So this is whose pen? Whose? So whose noun? Right. So noun is pen. So whose pen? Answer is my pen. So the word my describes the noun pen. So that my is adjective. Right. Now we go for kinds. So we have to get to know how many kinds of adjectives are there. So there are usually seven kinds of adjectives. What are they? Adjective of quality, adjective of quantity, adjective of number, adjective that is demonstrative adjective, possessive adjective, interrogative adjective, and distributive adjective. Distributive pronoun is also there. So that is <coughs> distributive adjective. So quality, quantity, number, demonstrative, possessive, Interrogative, distributive. So we have to discuss the kinds of adjective. So what is adjective of quality? What is adjective of quantity? What is adjective of number? Just like that. So on. So now we are starting kinds of adjective. So first one is adjective of quality. What is adjective of quality? It tells how the noun or pronoun is. The noun or pronoun. So how the noun is? Well, so what are the answer we get? That is adjective of quality. So we can just to recognize or just to find out adjective, we have to ask noun. Because it tells or it describes noun. So we have to ask how the noun is. And if we get the answer, then whatever the answer we get, that word must be adjective. So example. Shonali is a nice girl. How is the girl? Girl is noun or Shonali is noun? How is Shonali? Answer is nice. How is the girl? Nice. So we are asking the noun that is Shonali or girl with the word how and we are getting the answer nice. So that nice is adjective of quality. Clear? Next, my room is untidy. So how the room is? My room is how? So room is room noun? 
So now, so how the noun is? No, noun is untidy. That is my room is untidy. So that untidy is adjective of quality. Next, my mother cooked a delicious dish. Well, so cooked a delicious dish. How the dish is? What dish? What dish cooked? What dish? Delicious dish. We are asking questions to the noun dish. How the dish is? Delicious. Answer is delicious. So that delicious is adjective of quality. So my mother cooked a delicious dish. Delicious is adjective of quality. Next, she bought a new book. What a book? How the book is? Which book she bought? So how the book is? Book is new. So new is adjective of quality. Next, Ruby collected some old stamps. Well, so collected old stamps. So how the stamps are? Stamps are old. So, we, so the word old describes the noun stamps. Old. So old is adjective of quality. Hope you can understand. So what is adjective of quality? Now you can find out or you can pick out adjective of quality from the sentences. Right? Next we go for adjective of quantity. So next adjective of quantity. So quantity. That means it tells about the quantity of the noun. So how much the noun is there. How much? So quantity. Which cannot be counted. Well, which cannot be counted. So nouns are there. The nouns which cannot be counted. That is called quantity. Milk. Milk cannot be counted in number. Well, but we can describe it. Well, how much the milk is there. Then it will be quantity. Example, there is some milk. Some milk. More milk. So some milk. So here the word some, here the word some actually describes that how much the milk is there. Well, so it's, it tells about the quantity of milk. Now, milk is noun. So it describes noun milk. The word some describes noun milk. So that some is adjective of quantity. Next, he makes less profit. Profit cannot be counted. Right? Profit cannot be counted. So how much the profit is? No, he makes less profit. The word less describes the noun profit. So less is quantity. It tells about the quantity of the profit. So it's an adjective of quantity. Next, see, we had heavy rainfall in the last month. We had heavy rainfall in the last month. So heavy rainfall. Rainfall is noun. The word heavy describes noun. Well, how much rainfall was there? No, heavy rainfall was there. Right? So heavy, adjective of quantity. Next, D. It does not make much sense. It does not make much sense. So much, adjective of quantity. Cause, because it describes the word sense. Next. He made more progress. Progress is now. So, so how much progress is making? No, he made more progress in his studies. So more. Right? He quantifies. The word quantifies the noun progress. So that is it's called adjective of quantity. Clear? Next we go for adjective of number. So next we go for Adjective of number. Adjective of number. So number. It tells how many nouns are there. Nouns or pronouns are there. How many nouns or pronouns are there. How many things are there. So we can count it. The nouns that can be counted is adjective of. I mean it will be converted into adjective of number. That cannot be counted. That will go for adjective of quantity. So nouns can be counted. So how many nouns are there? Whatever the answer we get, that answer must be adjective of number. There are many children. So we can count 
how many children are there so many children are there many and to give up number there are many children playing in the field so many children many adjective of number next ruby has got two story books how many story books ruby has got two story books noun story books the word to describes the noun story books how many story books are there two story books are there so it's adjective of number next he has many friends how many friends are there many friends many many is adjective of number next most boys like cricket most boys so we can count how many boys most boys well so boys can be counted so that most is adjective of number next ayush has got many toys many toys toys can be counted the word many is adjective of number right this is adjective of number so adjective of quality adjective of quantity adjective of number next we go for demonstrative adjective possessive adjective right demonstrative adjective will go for now we go for demonstrative adjective what is demonstrative adjective so demonstrative that means it demonstrates or shows demonstrate means showing so it demonstrates or shows who the noun <clears throat> so that is called demonstrative adjective example this bag is hers so the word this actually shows bag this bag so we are demonstrating we are showing this bag is hers next b this plural of this these apples are rotten these apples are rotten so we are showing we are pointing the apples right next see that car is mine that car again we are showing we are demonstrating well so that here the word that describes the car so that that is demonstrative adjective d those those birds are flying in the sky those birds those birds so showing birds demonstrating so those are demonstrative adjective right next we go for possessive adjective so position that's a having so it's it's all about having so it tells about the position of the noun well that which belongs to the noun right example this is my car this is my car well so my my car my s yes? possessive so it's a my that i'm going to show that i'm going to tell so this my car the word my describes the word car look at hard dress hard so that means hard dress the dress belongs to hard that is why it's called possessive adjective hard dress number c she is his cousin whose cousin his cousin well so his is possessive adjective next we go for interrogative adjective that is asking questions well so asking questions to the noun with which word with what which whose these are the three words what which whose these are the three words with which we ask the noun that is interrogative adjective that is what time and you see the word actually describes now mm -hmm. time what time is it now which pen which pen are you using see whose bag whose bag is lying there whose bag now bag pen now time now well so the what what which whose mm -hmm. so with these words we are asking the questions we are asking the questions and we are describing now that's what these are called interrogative adjectives next we go for the last one that is distributive adjective distributive so we can distribute so these are the words three words are there each either neither so we can distribute well each boy each boy each boy gets good marks neither girl neither girl is known to me neither girl so that is distributive so these are distributive adjective so hope you understand the kinds of adjective clear next we go for 
the degree of comparison. So each and every adjective is the adjective of quality mainly. So adjective of qualities are there. So those are having three degrees: positive, superlative, and uh, positive, comparative, and superlative. Three degrees are there. So we will discuss the degree of comparison of adjective in our next video. Well.